Hello everybody, welcome back to Food of Dad Cubed. Right, today I am going to make a trifle. Yeah, this is the best pudding in the whole wide world, I reckon. Yeah, especially around this time. I think this is going to go out around Christmas time. Especially around this time, Christmas time, into the new year. Make yourself a nice trifle, it is beautiful. It's old fashioned, it's sweet, and it is gorgeous. Yeah, in my eyes. <laughs> That's the only eyes I've got. So, let's show you the ingredients. Right, here we go. Full fat milk, custard powder, some double cream, some sponges, a bit of jelly to put in it, and some mixed fruit. And it all goes together and becomes a beautiful trifle. Right, I'll show you how to put it together. Right, here we go, first things first, get some hot water. Yeah, on the pack of the jelly it says you use a pint of water, half first of all and half later, but I'm only gonna make half the consistency of that for my trifle. So I'm putting a quarter of hot water first of all, about three quarters of the jelly, because I like my jelly a bit strong. Goes in there, splashes everywhere. That's what you do there, just milk this down. You must have made jelly before, I think. If not, this is the time to make it. <laughs> right, milk this down. And when it goes through nice, when it's all melted in, we put it in the pot, right? That goes to one side. Well, this is the pot I'm gonna make the trifle in, yeah? What you do, get your old on your trifle, your sponges, you put them in the bottom here like that. Right, and that's it. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Get yourself some of the fruit I made. This is the fruit I done made. That I opened the tin up with. That goes in the bottom. About half that tin I'm gonna put in there. I like a lot of fruit in my thingy. And that's what happens now is once the jelly's all melted down, jelly goes on top of this and we put it away. I put the old jelly, let it melt down, I come back to it, I pour it on, and I'll show how I do it. Mm. Melty, melty. Still got the old sponge here, yeah? What I've done now, I've just got, I've made the jelly up. I've made the jelly up, I put, a quarter pint of water in with the, the, the jelly cubes, melted them down, and made the quarter pint of mixture up with the juice from the the, from the, the old bits here, the old fruit, and a bit more cold water, yeah? And this just goes on the top here. And this goes in here, settles nicely down. Beautiful. And that goes into the fridge now, or on the side for a little while, just to cool down, so it starts to, it starts to um, Congeal, congeal, one word. Starts to go jellyfied, then I put it in the fridge, and when it's nice and set, I bring it out and we do the rest. It takes a bit of time, but it's worth it in the long run. Right, the jelly's set in the, in the fridge here, it's set in there, it's just a little bit, little bit longer, so I'm gonna make some custard now. Custard's easy to make, it's usually, it says it in the back of the old pot here, but I'll show you how to go through it here. You want, you want a um, tablespoonful of sugar, two of them, Two tablespoons of sugar. Or if you're a sweet tooth, a bit more, you know what I mean? It doesn't really matter. And the old custard powder, another two tablespoons of custard powder. Get a bit more, I want the old custard to be a bit thick, so I'm gonna put another one in. I'm gonna put three of them in, so I want it to be a bit thick here. Yeah. That's what you do, you've got your pint of milk. Yeah, you take a little bit of pint of milk, just a little bit, you wanna put it in there, you're gonna mix it up and make a paste. So let's do that in there, just get that in, make a little paste of that, so when you pour it into the milk, it doesn't go all fluffy on top, yeah? And as you notice then, the sugar I put in was actually icing sugar, because I didn't know granulated sugar. <laughs> so it's <long. laughs> I think it does good, it probably be a bit sweeter actually. Right, let's do that like that. Just a nice little mixture there. All the rest, the pot goes in here. All the rest of the milk goes into the pot. That's a pint of milk, or half a litre. Right, right, this goes on the stove now <coughs> to its simmers, yeah? Bring it to a simmer. When it simmers, we put the rest of this on, on top of it and keep on stirring. I'll show you how we do that, yeah? There we go, it's coming to, the, coming to a nice simmer now. Just put a nice no gas. You do want the milk to burn, really. Right, you get the stuff you had before, you just pour it into the milk. Sorry, cameraman, I have no ninja in me, isn't it? You just keep on mixing this now. You want it to go thick, so you just keep on mixing, yeah? A little bit taste to its, to its on. Sweet enough? Oh, that is lovely. I've got to pour that on a bit of pudding there and scoff it. Right, take that back over there and prepare it. But we've got to let it cool all the way down first of all. Then we're going to mix some cream and put it on top of it when it's cool. It's a long process, this, but it's worth it at the end because it is gorgeous. Right, why is that the old custard is waiting to cool down? I'm going to just give it a mix of cream. I think I've done this before. Just want to, so it's going to be nice and thick to go on top of the, um, 
Give it nice and thick to go on top of the trifle, okay? I've got about 300 milligrams here, I think I've about, about half, I think. About 150 milligrams I do. Get the old whisk, in a nice slow mode first of all. Start whisking away, sorry about the noise. It takes a fair bit, it's a bit noisy this one, but we do it by hand, it does take quite a while, but this goes quite quickly I think. I'd actually zoom it up a bit more. Whoa! Full speed ahead! Beautiful, pick up cool just now. Right, that's it. Lovely thick cream to go on top of the custard and the trifle when it's cooled down. That's the old trifle we made before. It's been in the fridge now, it's all nice and set. Custard has gone off. A good thing about custard, we want to do a bit of clean from over the top. Yeah, stops it. Get a, a skin on top, that one. Little tip there. I think everybody knows that, but little tip. Right, so you put a layer of custard, don't need all this. A nice layer of custard, wash that on. See, it's lovely and cold, this custard now. Wash that on like that. Enough custard in that. And get the, the, the um, cream that you've done before. Just get some cream. Put that on top as well. Just build up another layer. We finish it off the top. Just get the old, I think they're called multi-colour 100,000 we used to call them. Just sprinkle them over a little bit. <laughs> kind of little kiddie bit. Might be a kiddie bit then. Right. There we go. A lovely little trifle there. It tastes gorgeous of course. I mean, that's got to go in the fridge now. Let it settle into itself for about another hour and we'll do a tasting again, all right? I'll put it out in the fridge. Well, as they say, the taste is in the pudding, yeah? <laughs> yeah, something like that. Let's cough this. Oh. <laughs> Just takes me back. Just Christmas. Oh. Absolutely beautiful. The custard, the sweetness of it. Oh, gorgeous.